Hello, this is just a really quick video to show you how to use the new multi-divider to drive a few drums. So in this patch, I'm using the LFO to clock the multi-divider. And I have patched a few of the division outputs into various drum kit samples. And I'm also driving the kick drum via the TRIG-164. And the way I'm doing this is that the TRIG-164 gets the same clock from the LFO as the multi-divider. And I have two different, two, two different sequences here, one that has uh, the kick on every fourth beat and one that has a more interesting pattern. Give it a bit of a fill. And I'm using the 3VC switch to switch between the two. So if I click the latch button, then I get the one pattern and click it again, I get the other pattern. So that's um, quite, quite good, the switch to, to use that stuff. So the output of the switch is then going to the kick. So I will start with the slower pattern. That's pattern number two. So on the switch, that's the B. And then just have a listen what that sounds like. So you could see that by uh, shifting the pattern, because um, number one is always active with every clock beat, you can actually shift the fill to each of the different drum kits and then use them uh, to, to fill out the sound. The little twins, trick 164 with the switch is just a gimmick that I added to uh, give it a little bit of extra interest. But basically, the Fibonacci is a really nice sequence actually for some interesting, probably more jazzy drum styles. Especially if you turn the pattern all the way to the right, it's, it's very infrequent that anything really happens and gets that um, more organic feel. Well, try that out for yourself. I think it's a very nice um, module to uh, trigger drums with.